welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, then a little introduction. This is a place to share stories, adventures, and everything I wish I had known before I'm breaking on them. My name is Trina, and you're watching from Fiji to here. In today's video, we are still in Tunisia, specifically in... Resujbel. Where we're staying at a beach house for a week. Now, the beach house is absolutely stunning and beautiful, so I couldn't keep that from you guys. So today, we're going to do an entire house tour on it. Let's go! So this is what I would say the front tour. We have a beautiful tiling along the walls, matching the tiling in here, where we have an outdoor uh, laundry station. We're going to rinse your suits off after a day at the beach, or just kind of like tidy up everything outside before you get in. That's not the front door. This one's the front door. Of course, we have the double doors opening up to the patio and right out to the beach. And then, how much you love the beach house? So again, tons of space for entertaining. We've got your tables here, your bench. Jolly Jumper is not included. Um, <laughs> that is a specialty item for us. But tons of places to entertain, have people over, things like that. Obviously, not so much during COVID times, but we're gonna head down to the beach. Side of the house here, you do have another building here that hosts a studio apartment, so if you have anyone coming to help, things like that. Um, there's a room and a little kitchenette in there. There's also a pool in the works, it's not quite ready yet, but uh, a little deep dive pool. We found our way back to the front door, we're actually going to take it up a level to the second stage. Second stage? Second floor of the house. So again, we're not staying in the room of a lot, so we can just crack the door briefly. It does have a walk-in bathroom. This room here does have a double bed and a single bed, as you saw, for the own walk-in walk bathroom, quick shower, a toilet, and a sink. This one here is our room. 
the three of us are staying in here. It's a truck with a double bed, a bunch of camera equipment and whatnot across the headboard. Um, we have a chain case station for Lisa and her cot. We did choose this room over the other one just because of the amount of storage space and closet space. So we do have all of our clothing and belongings in here. So all of the rooms here are equipped with AC. Again, we have a beautiful bathroom as well. The tiling is matching all of our ridiculous amount of products. We have a nice big shower, the toilet, and again, tons of storage space, just even like under the sink, as well as like, there's whoop, two shelving. So like Elisa's bathtub is normally under there as well. And then we're gonna head to the last spot, but probably my favorite spot of the house. So unlike most of the other doors, this one does not look better behind us, but I found something even better. So you come to this little alcove that has a perfect place for drying your clothes. We have reached the bright and sunny balcony. So we enter this off both doors or both bedrooms upstairs do enter off onto the balcony as well as the little alcove. And you have this big, beautiful, gorgeous balcony. Definitely my favorite place of the house. It's where I get a lot of work done, where I'll do my workouts in the morning. And like I said, it does, and, um, you can enter off of our bedroom as well. It's just like this here. Great back, so I can hear if Alicia's sleeping, crying, anything like that. Another special feature that isn't specific to this house, but it's something that I haven't seen in Canada, um, are these these like window like window blinds slash shades. Um, so they're completely electronic, you can put them down. And I'll show you because there's two different features. This is really nice as opposed to blackout curtains. It's just so much quicker, easier. The wind doesn't blow it away. Um, so you can leave it like this, where you have the opening so that you can still kind of get a breeze through. Or if you keep going down, completely blacks out, which is awesome for Lisa's trying to sleep. That sums it up for this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. See you in the next one.